Abby, goodbye. I love you. So the hurricane didn't take that shirt away? It did not. It made a return, actually. I'm gonna get that shirt. No, you're not. One of these days, that shirt's mine. I'm keeping this shirt forever. I'm gonna burn it. Go to work. Bye. Bye. Oh look, this hurricane pulled more clear cut off my truck. And this one's in the shape of the Playboy Bunny. Classy. Hey guys, so we still have no power, which, you know, it's not a big deal, right guys? It's yeah. not a big deal. It could have been way worse, so we're okay with not having power. We um, have the generator, so we're okay. Yep. I am headed to pick Asa up with all of our yard tools here so we can go and help Abby's school. Um, they got hit pretty hard and have a lot of work to do. I don't know if it's necessarily damaged. We haven't, we haven't, we don't know that yet. So Asa and I are going to head over there and help them. Isaiah is going to stay with Abby. are going to stay at the house and Isaiah is going to work on homework. We're going to have a good time. So we're gonna work on homework. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. It's hot. It's getting hot. It's hot down here, but upstairs it's really nice. Like there's a yeah, good. Yeah, I think we need to open more windows. All right, picked up this guy. Hi. <laughs> I had. Um... Oh, 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 oh! Blow your horn! Blow your horn! <laughs> okay, I could have ran over his own lawnmower. That's okay. We can fix it. He's not happy with his friend. <laughs> I had like three uh, generators dropped off of the shop while I was there working on chainsaws. Uh, I got one done, the other one, the carburetor soaking, and then I got the third one to do, but we got to go do this first, um, help out at Abby's school. It's a priority, I think. <laughs> we got to get those kids back to school. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then we will go back to the shop and I will try to get as much out as I can. There's everybody's just doing cleanup. Got the kids out there working. Look at all this churn. Spending the last couple days at home, even though it was during a hurricane, really spoiled me. I didn't want to come to work. At all. Not at all. I just want to hang out with my family the whole time. If the audio is a little different, we're kind of jumping around between three different cameras, so I'm sorry. We're a little busy. That's a little crazy. I left my other camera in Priscilla's car, so I got, I got this little... This is my original vlogging camera. See? Isn't that cute? It's my original camera. Hi. Hi! You sitting in the front room? I am. It's it's so much cooler in here. <laughs> like it's because it's dark. I'm hot. It was fine like the first two days because the temperatures were lower. Now it's 80 something degrees and it's starting. It's starting to get old. It's starting to get a little bit old. Yay! We got our water thing for the hurricane. I'm so excited. It's not really Amazon's fault. It's UPS's fault. Yeah. UPS dropped the ball. We ordered this so that we could use like tap water and still have like good clean taste in water because our, our tap water is kind of kind of meh. So we ordered this well before the hurricane. It was supposed to be here like Friday and it didn't show up till today. Fancy. We're ready for the next one. That's right. Well, we'll put it in the fridge and we'll have, you know, good, big. good cheap drinking water. We don't have to have like a special place for it. Yeah, we we'll like slide it in there and then you can just... Isn't that cool? Yep. Can you make some coffee right now, though? I really need coffee. I'm so tired. <laughs> you you look like you look like the kid from Pokemon. Why? With a hat. Why? What's his name? Ash. I don't know. Ash is from Pokemon. Hmm. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. How's everybody? Good. You're on the vlog. Say hi to the vlog, mom. 
<laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> I went down digging sweet taters. <laughs> when you called. Digging sweet taters, huh? Yeah. Cool. I was. Yeah, I was going to send you a picture, but um, it started drizzling and I had to put the chickens away. And so I just put my car of sweet potatoes in my shed. Ah. Oregon. Oregon tomorrow. So. Well, I called you because um, I, I got a secret email. A secret? A secret. And I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Well, but if you tell me, then it won't be a secret. Well, you know how I am with like Christmas presents and stuff, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so do tell. All right, hold on. Huh, I can't tell them on the vlog yet, so hold on, let me. Hey, you want to tell me about your day? Was it a good day? Girl, it's hot in the house, huh? You sweaty? Sweaty? Here, close the fridge. Baby girl, we're gonna eat lunch or eat dinner in a minute. Okay? We're gonna cook in just a little while. We'll be fine. Don't tell me yet. Okay, I got my cold shower. Not because I wanted a cold shower, because the generator doesn't run the water heater and we still don't have electricity. Um, you would think that a cold shower would feel amazing when you don't have AC, but it's really just, it's extremely shocking because your body temperature's higher and it's, it's rough. It takes a long time to get used to it. Speaking of showers, um, we need to give Abigail a bath because, you know, children, they're gross. The hard part is I can't tell Abigail like I can Isaiah. You know, I can just tell Isaiah, look, you have to take a cold shower. That's all there is to it. Sorry about your luck. Can't really communicate that to Abigail very well. So I've got Priscilla's gumbo pot, the grill out back, heating up and uh, we're gonna add that to some bath water and get just the perfect temperature of bath. Which gives me a great opportunity uh, to talk about the Sudbuds thing that we got in the mail from Sudbuds. Now you guys know I've told you before that I don't really look at products that I don't think that, that could benefit you somehow or something that your kid wouldn't like or something that doesn't directly apply um, to autism. And I think this would apply to a lot of kids, uh, but I know a lot of children with autism are big in animals. I like this product because it does talk about animals. It gives you, it's not just a cute picture of a tiger. It, it, Benji the tiger here, it actually talks about animals and you can learn about animals. Like for example, a tiger's lifespan is 20 years. It's a carnivore and it weighs up to 310 pounds. Amazing. So opening up the box, we got, what is this? Sudprize, win a pair of virtual reality glasses with a special code. Visit sudprize.com. Enter your code, see if you want. Here you go, you want a, a pair of virtual reality glasses? Just pause the video right there. And then we have the bath bomb. It smells good. I think she'll like it. So if you saw the other video when we got this in the mail, there is a companion app that comes with it. It's called Sudbuds Run, and it's a game. Pretty cool looking. Sounds like jungle music. Okay, so you can hit play or scan. To, you can scan, you can scan that image on the box right there. So we'll do that. Scan now. There we go, it's scanned. Now what do I do? So it says Jungle Jam Benji Unlocked. Okay, so you can unlock six different characters, it looks like. Oh, there's a VR mode on here. That's why they have the VR glasses you can get. That's cool. I might have to try that. I've got a pair of VR glasses. So we select our, our tiger. It fills a bathtub up. How cute is that? How to play, jump, move, slide. Sure. I am the greatest ever. Isaiah, wanna try this game? Okay, Isaiah's the gamer of the family, so. I am terrible. Let's do this. Jump. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh. Collecting coins. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Okay, cool game. Awesome that it's like interactive with the, with the product. I like that. Um, most important part, bath bomb. Let's go put this in the bathtub. It's so heavy. It's so heavy. Let's see what I do. It's my child. I think it was heavy. Okay, let's do a temperature check. Yep, that's good. Come on. Okay. 
Put this in. Put it in. Look at that. Look at the bubbles. Isn't that exciting? Oh, it's fizzy. You feel it? Come here. Come here, look. Isn't that cool? Oh, it turns the water green, Abby. All right, you want to get in the bath with it? No, you don't want to get in there. You want to wait for it to go away? We'll wait for it to dissolve first. <laughs> Labby's enjoying her her nice bath with her uh, with her fizzy bath suds. I I'm I give it a thumbs up. It's cool. It's a cool product. I love that it comes with the game and all that. And you know, I recommend it. I'll leave a link for it right down below for you guys if you want to check them out. Well, instead of Abigail's normal attire for bed that you guys have seen in numerous videos. We're doing some regular big girl pajamas. <laughs> what do you think? It's just too hot, guys. It's like 80 degrees in the house. So uh, we're going to have to deal with it if she makes a mess. That's just all there is to it because she can't sleep in that stuff in this heat. I'm going to let the fan run in here um, till, till we go to bed. That way it keeps the room nice and cool while she's falling asleep and gets to sleep. And then after that, once generator goes out, no more fan. But that's how all of us are sleeping, so. Are you so comfy in your big girl jamas? I love this camera that we put in Abby's room. Best thing ever. Again, I'm gonna talk about that in an upcoming video. Promise. But you know, since she's not wearing her pajamas, I can make sure that she's actually asleep now that I've left the room and uh, not not shredding her pull up or destroying anything. So, very cool. Love this. You've probably noticed at this point in some of the shots that we've got like bars, horizontal bars going up and down the screen, however. Um, that's because we're running off of a generator and like hertz, however many hertz the generator is putting out, and so the light bulbs are like science. There's lots of noise. The video quality is probably not amazing. Just yeah, I apologize. I'm doing the best that I can. <laughs> that sound behind that wall is Isaiah taking a cold shower. Hashtag real life. So I have a secret. I have a secret for you guys. I got an email from YouTube. See, it says, "Hey, Father Autism. We know keeping a secret is hard." but we'll need to keep this under wraps for now. Think you're up to the challenge? No. Okay, here's the super secret secret. You've been chosen as a YouTube creator on the rise. Woohoo. They actually typed out woohoo. That means your channel will be featured on the trending tab in the US within the next 24 hours. We have to keep this between us for now, but we'll send you an email as soon as your channel is featured. That's when you can share this exciting news and check out your videos in the trending tab. Obviously, I'm not uploading this video until that becomes a thing because YouTube said it was a secret and I'm a rule follower. But I wanted to share that with you guys, new subscribers, old subscribers, all of you. Uh, and the biggest reason is to say thank you. The reason that we are an upcoming, a, a rising YouTube channel uh, star is because of you guys. Because you guys, you, you new subscribers, for example, you saw an interesting thumbnail on in your suggested videos and you clicked on it. And you gave me 15 to 20 minutes of your day to watch a video. Ended up saying, yeah, I can handle these guys three, four times a week. And you subscribed. And you commented. And you said, I don't have anybody in my family with autism. I don't know anything about autism. But I love your channel and I'm learning a lot about autism. And that is, man, that's that's like... When I, the reasons for our YouTube channel, I mean, uh, that's like a tie for first. That autism awareness that we push for, and it's so amazing that you guys are so open-minded, and and you really want to learn, and you want to you want to absorb this information. And, you know, I had someone comment um, just this week that that they saw a child that they're pretty sure had autism out in public, and they thought of Abigail. And then you know that is that is that awareness that we just we preach about and. That's awesome. Our old school subscribers, you know who you are. You've been around since the very beginning when we had 100 subscribers or 500 subscribers or 1,000 subscribers. You guys that, that were with us every step of the way. You've commented on every single video. Uh, you know, we, we've created this like 
personal relationship even in the in the YouTube comments. You guys have stuck with us through through the good times, through the bad times, uh, times you didn't agree with me on some on a topic, and and you just keep coming back for more, and you keep supporting our channel and promoting it to other people. And man, I I really really appreciate it. Our Patreon supporters, uh, you guys that have jumped over to that to that other realm over to Patreon and, and said, you know what? We're going to support this channel. When I first started posting videos on YouTube, it was solely for the purpose of keeping memories. You know, putting things up there, sharing them with family members, uh, showing cool cool new things that Abigail has learned how to do. Uh, you know, just preserving memories of Isaiah dancing with his robot and, and Abigail running around the house playing. Uh, you know, Abigail getting a drink for the first time. Then to share with the public, it all started with, with the service dog video and just grew from there. I decided that I was going to do it because I loved doing it. I loved the interaction uh, between myself and viewers and answering questions. And I just, I love creating videos. It just became, it became a thing. And then it grew, and it grew, and then it really, really grew. And I just want to say thank you, guys. But anyway, that was just a really long way of saying thank you. It's it's you guys. The reason why we got that email from YouTube is because of you guys, because of your support, because you guys found our channel, and you went went back and binged watch all of our videos. And that's, that's the reason. Uh, that's why we're at where we're at. And I just, I'm so humbled and so appreciative and you guys are great that is all for today guys thank you guys so much for spending the day with us checking out the 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 bath bomb the awesome sudsy thing uh that was pretty cool i again i'm not gonna pitch something that i don't believe in this is not a sponsor video uh they sent me the product you know free to try out obviously but i i give it a thumbs up it's pretty cool if your kids and animals and and you like them to smell good then get, get that bath bomb. But yeah, again, I, I can't say it enough. Thank you. We appreciate it. We love you. Um, show some love down in the comments. Pat yourself on the back. Just say, hey, I'm an awesome fan of fathering autism. <laughs> we will see you next time. Bye. If anybody has any air conditioning that I can borrow, my brain is melting. I can't make my words work. They won't come out of my face right. I can I shoot the rest of the video like this? It's like the only position I can be in where I feel not hot. Except for when she rolls over and her eyes are open. That's creepy. Because her eyes glow in the dark. And you're like, I'm not going in there. Nope. What you doing, Ace? Getting gas. <laughs> you spilling like some gas this morning? <laughs> Why are you doing this? Um, because there is a very long line at the one gas station that has fuel. So. <laughs> <clears throat> this is gas for our generator. Oh my gosh. Ah. He got it. Is that the worst? It's pretty much the worst. <laughs>